I'm Rashada Baldwin, and I will be talking about Women's History Month and the women who contribute to the great history of this country. And I'm Brendan Greeley. I'll be talking about the Southside Irish Parade and the banner on Western Avenue to honor my Uncle Tom Leonard. Welcome to Chinatown for good in Chicago. We are at the Chinese American Museum of Chicago, 238 West 23rd Street. I'm Brendan Greeley. And I'm Roshana Baldwin, and it's super excited to be here in Chinatown. We got a chance to explore the museum and see all the great uh, ex exhibitions. How about that? How cool is that railroad exhibit? It was very cool. That gave a lot of insight on how the railroad was built and that we didn't acknowledge or didn't even know that the Chinese created and was really instrumental. They was almost rewritten out of history according yeah. to the pictures that we saw. So about that? I definitely want you all to check out the exhibit that's here until the end of the year. Yeah, exactly. It's one of the good things about Chicago and that's of course the purpose of this show to point out the positive things about the Chicago things instead happening. of all the negative stuff. So. Absolutely. And Speaking of which, month, March is uh -huh. uh, Women's History Month. Yes. Did you know that? I didn't really know that you until had, you told me. Okay. So I want to highlight some great women from Chicago or around the uh, country mm -hmm. uh, who are doing great work and have been acknowledged for the great work that they have done. Yeah. Ida B. Wells. This activist, this great lady who did great things um, in the late 1800s and early 1900s, she was an activist, she did a lot for uh, the community. Recently, her uh, name, she was got a street name after her. It was yes. renamed the Congress Parkway. They, uh -huh. It was uh, July of this year, over the summer, um, individuals, including her family, got together to rename and honor Ida B. Wells for her contribution to Humankind, humanitarian. Yeah, that's a great honor. Efforts. It's a great honor. That's, so a, kudos that's a major to her. thoroughfare, too. It Congress is Parkway. It's huge. I yeah. thought most time when you get these street renamings, you get the smaller streets, but yeah. she got the big one. Um, what else? The election. April 2nd, we know, is the runoff. And big. how historical is Tony Preckwinkle, our Cook County Board President, and Lori Lightfoot both in a runoff? First time in history that two African American women will be uh, a mayor, will be are in a runoff to be the next mayor of Chicago so these women are doing great things and this is exciting to see um, that these two women are in a runoff that is pretty cool yes and um, that's what I have so far honoring those great Chicagoans who are doing good things in the city and our women for Women's History Month all right Roshana well my good thing is the month of March is also known for a little holiday called St. Patrick's Day. Yeah. You might notice I'm, I see. I'm all decked out. Um, and of course, being Irish American myself, I, I celebrated quite a bit over the course of St. Patrick's Day weekend. You know, drank at some of the bars on the north side. Did you, did then you. Then went down for the south side parade and I was super excited because my late uncle, my late legendary uncle, Tom Leonard, God, they, his, St. Patrick's Day was his day. He made sure on the south side that you were going to have a good time on St. Patrick's Day, and I did every year. And uh, they put up a banner for him on Western Avenue during the parade. Oh, it just it it's touched amazing. my heart. It's amazing. That's yep. cool. I'm even wearing his uh, his sweatshirt. Are you? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. I love mm -hmm. the uh, parade. I've oh. been to the parade. It's the South Side Parade a is a good time. Yep. And, and I got my little <laughs> I got my Irish drinking glove right here. So yeah, I got some other. I guess got a hat for you if you want. Awesome. You want? It, oh, mm -hmm. which one? Which one? Let me see. Yeah. The cool <laughs> cool thing about that one, it, it even has a, a a bottle opener on it. You know what? <laughs> that is funny. That's funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yes, it's a twist off. He struck. <laughs> it's a tip. <laughs> so I love it. I don't drink beer, but I will rock this hat. And um, I'm happy that you came to the south side of Chicago and didn't call me, but that's okay. Yeah, We're no longer friends after this episode. <laughs> but Fair enough. Next time. Next year for sure. Speaking of which, did mm -hmm. you know our former first lady is huh? Irish American or half Irish? Guess who that is? Which one? Guess who? I'm the lovely, the fabulous, the fabulous Jackie O. Oh. Who doesn't love Jackie Kennedy Onassis. Not wow. only is she half Irish, she was married to the great um, Jack Kennedy. Jack Kennedy. Mm -hmm. So cool. That's a to good this picture of Jackie young, She got a lot of 
great work as well and she was known for her style sophistication um, gave a lot to charity did a lot to charity for charity and were very known for her fashion and got the great name of Jackie O after she married the billionaire. So kudos to her because she's also an Irish American yeah. doing great things as well. After God rest her beautiful soul. Yes, yes. Absolutely. So. Very nice. Well noted. Thank you, Rashawn. You're welcome. You I like us it. in our green gloves. <laughs> You want to chow down on some? Yeah. Want to go for food, and we got some. Go for it. Yeah, gopher. it's right down the block on Twenty Third Street, so we got uh, got some nice vegan fare. And this is vegan friendly. Yeah. So I'm see, I'm learning a little bit about vegan life from you. Well, thank you. You know. Hmm. Very good. Actually. Very delicious. Oh yeah. I love it. I like this a lot. Hmm. Could make you it. make this? Would you uh, try to? <laughs> would you try to do the I recipe? Make it, but, <laughs> but I'm learning to appreciate the vegan life. Good mm. food in Chinatown. Mm. Excellent. I like that. This has been a presentation of Old Pie Productions. Tony, can you shut up?